Yo, you know, one thing I realized is that sometimes you don't need to explain yourself. Just let things be the way they are. You understand? Anyway, let me get back to what I was doing. Guys, hold up. I don't know if I am the only one here, but I have this this special joy seeing Millie right here with Marvin. I would give you guys my reason, right? I feel Millie is one person. He's blunt and he is real. He is real, like his authenticity is on 100. But I feel like he do not really have the opportunity to fly. I don't know if you guys get me. So I have this feeling that Marvin is a helping hand to Millie. And I feel so glad about it. When I see the two of them together, like I don't want to even use my ear to hear Marvin has, sorry, Millie has gone back. Like I derive this joy seeing Marvin and Millie together. Like it feels like it's giving, you know, friends helping each other. I don't know if I am the only one seeing it this way. Do you also see those two that way? Let me know what you think in the comment section. But first of all, introduction hey babies what's up my darling mvps and how you all doing welcome back to sale with mimi shortly mimi where you get the gist i see they do waiting i see the heart of course, you know there is no sleeping on a bicycle on this channel. If you snooze, you do what? You lose. Are you yet to subscribe to this channel? Or are you still sitting on a fat, long thing? Kindly pause right there. Subscribe and make sure you turn on the notification bell. If not, tell me. How do you want to get the gist brewing from the cooking pot? Like, how do you want to get the gist? I see the hot. Coming from Mutati Wendy Madiba, wishing everyone a week filled with purpose and productivity. May each day be marked by progress towards your goals and may challenge be opportunities for growth. Oh, I love this part. May challenges be opportunities, opportunities for growth. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Stay focused, stay motivated and make the most of every moment. Here is to a week of accomplishment and sources that is coming from Mutati Wendy my baby Madiba and then she also said and the YouTube Q&A will drop tomorrow guys that tomorrow is today so get ready you should stay tuned all right guys moving forward the Kobangas decided not to let us rest wish we could rewind back to this day Kobang my liver Kobangas are one delusional shippers that I actually will carry my two um orange up for my two bobbies up for because this this um ship never relents they were sharing amazing videos of kosi and tabang and i won't lie to you guys i was really watching them one by one mm -hmm. i was really watching them one by one if it's not for one or one or two ish i'm having with um youtube currently i would have shared most of those videos here so that you guys would enjoy with me Kosi and Tabang moments was actually truly those two with, with the way they were acting it up in the house. It was giving the like each other, but something something you know when you like someone and it won't work out. That's what the Kobang was giving. The love is there, but it definitely won't work out. That's what it was giving. Like they have this unique chemistry. I was just looking at the video. I'm like, wait, are you sure the Kobang shippers are not trying to get me into the ship right now? <laughs> which is impossible guys which is so impossible but they actually have amazing moments in the house if you're a Kobang shipper and you've gotten to this section of this video it is maliciously me sending a huge shout out to you guys oh not too much <laughs> all right guys moving forward um this is coming from kosi forever please those in sa organize a meet and greet at the airport on kosi's arrival let's show them we are big our king can just come back without people waiting to receive her so as you can see the picture they use right here is the blue ever picture now why is this going on it's been going drags upon drags with um blue ever fans and um 
the cold sirens right i think one thing with these people is these drugs will never stop the same way it is going on for thatcher and mercy right now on bb niger streets you know is going on the same way for the Kosi Rens and the Blue Ever fans. When Kosi missed her trip with Opera, they didn't know us. They didn't allow us here. What Blue? Why did you update UK without going there now? Why didn't you go to Uganda? King Yemi Kres didn't give you money. At Blue Ever or levels no reach Kosi again. Like this one was tagging Yemi Kres to it. You guys, you guys, come on. You know, you know one thing that I said that it's always like a cycle on this baby street is that. The moment you come for people's faith, just know that your faith's turn is also coming. So now, the co are actually putting Blue Eva, they are dragging Blue Eva, you know, left, right and center. Because why? They've been also, the other families have also been coming for Kosi with her trip and everything. So now they are calling out on Blue Eva for, you know, I just said you guys about um, Blue Eva updating trips on her IG. Yes, I just said that one time. They are still calling out on her that why did her Uganda trip not also happen? Guys, it's just so toxic on that part. Like, it's too much. Meanwhile, talking about toxicity, let's say this. So, this person says, not Liema's IG following growing so fast you would swear she was on baby titans watched by the entire africa yeah liema is who she thinks she is true definition of being loved unlike that one who keeps traveling and trending for no reason her ig following pace is too slow you would swear she wasn't watched by the whole africa you would swear she wasn't a winner liema will reach this one's follower and pass them and then this person here said i like how cozy strip vacation are given the entire country chest pain now there is one thing you can ask not to like a person but some things are so visible that you cannot act turn a blind eye to and one thing that is so visible that you cannot turn a blind eye to is cozy that one is naturally doing well for herself you come about to talk about followers, you talk about this and that. All you're trying to create right here is to create drama between Kosi and um what's her name? Liema. And now the question is, what does what does these people really gain? What is the gain? Like, do they credit you? Are some of you all just been paid to do this? Because sometimes we know some people pay some people to do this thing they do. This is the thing they do. And then people will choose to sell their soul to the they will sell their soul to the devil just to drag people who did nothing to them. All, all those people who drag unnecessarily, believe you me, they are abnormal people. Nobody can tell me nada. Because a sane person cannot just come out, drag somebody that did not do anything to them. Even if naturally you do not like, like the person, that does not mean you should drag the person like that. You know, all right, they still did not stop there. This person said, also, stop forcing this friendship between Granny Kobosi and Lily. How can a 27 years old Magriza be friends with a 22 year old baby? What do they talk about? Make it make sense, please. Kobosi stands and forcey things, trying to make Granny Kobosi relevant using Liema's name because Liema is still fresh, trending, relevant, recent, and with fast idea oh my god <laughs> at this point i just paused because it's so so childish at this point you know if you want to talk about the clouds if you kosi is one name you would mention seasons are coming but kosi is still on trend you know that is why i said what i said about the what's the called the top charts that is the very first time that kosi did not appear from number one to ten ever since she left that bb titan house she has been appearing on top charts back to back without you know without even blinking an eye and now you're saying she's trying to use somebody for clashes now do you know where this is coming from so whilst they were trying to sell that narrative about comparison between kosi and liema which is something that should not even happen at all those fan base did not accept it because they just discovered that it is people from other fan base who want to just create rifts among them rather they started sharing pictures of liam and kosi they are like these two are friends nothing is going to happen to them you would only say what you want to say you know you know all this kind of talk people were expecting liema to come out of the house and then kosi would not like her because of the things liema said when kosi was in that show but you guys know kosi is somebody that do not have problem 
she she also went for Liema's homecoming. Out of all the housemates, she went for Liema's and Taki's homecoming. She did not even say no to that. But yet, fans still want to create that rift among them. Let them believe we are enemies. That time we are making money. Yeah, let's work, girl. You know, so their fans were sharing this thing in. That's why they are saying they are forcing friendship. Because they did not buy into the toxicity that person was trying to sell. You know? That is how it should be. When few people trying to do this thing, let people with larger number come up with positivity. That is the best way to go right now. Now they are saying she joined. Wow. And that time they are friends. They said Kosi joined what was because she traveled. Oh my God. People need to, people need to calm down and buy Apple. And I am sure Ileba Abusaka Koblu Labo. I do not know what that means. My king, keep doing you. People are burning outside and you don't even care. Kosi, the only king, have some respect, please. You can say that again. Yo, people are so pain now. Wow. Yo, jealous. It's just jealousy. And when you're jealous, when people are progressing, that means you're literally a witch. Yes, I said it. If you're a guy, you're a wizard. Any which way is on to the next one. I don't like it that Mark Jr. is getting so many drags because of this thing that happened. Now, podcasts are saying so many dirty things about him. You know, saying he ran away, I refused to pay the lady. You know, they are just selling different part of the story. And I think it's literally not good because that boy is somebody that has decided to stay out of drama. But yet, they're actually take, staining his name to the mud. This podcast are read things online and just make their silly judgments. I'm not saying MC Jr. shouldn't pay whoever he owes, but did MC Jr. ask her to run the account for him while he was on BBM? MC Jr. doesn't owe anyone he didn't assign to run his social media. And that is truth because this didn't happen in his absence. It was the sisters who did that, you know. So I don't think the way they are coming for MC Jr. is actually cool. It's not cool. No, no, no. This is not cool at all, you know. But I think also he has not even received some of his money. Not some, even the money. They don't receive that money on time. So coming for someone this way, I think is really not cool. Meanwhile, MC Junior fans, you guys should pay the lady now. <laughs> you guys should pay the lady now. The fans actually, um, what is it called? The fans, um, well, how do I want to put it? They actually made him win. So you guys join her together and make him win. So you guys should pay the lady now. Let's hear what. <laughs> <laughs> or is it because your fave is not active on the social space that's why you guys are not putting your mouth in this one any which ways guys i'm gonna be ending this on a lighter note and a better note yes this is a young puppy fan who came and said i don't think i have cared for a housemate the way i do for puppy that's really my boy oh this actually got me this actually got me it is so sweet especially for someone like young puppy whom has been receiving so many drugs it's so sweet to see that someone said they have actually not loved a person the way they love him this got to me i'm not gonna lie it really did got to me you know i'm an emotional person i'm so emotional you know but it's just that it's something i don't really show off but i feel so emotional easily and I feel for people easily. But I don't let it get to me or don't let people, you know, enter me through it. No ways. I am a counselor for a reason. Any which ways, guys. I'm going to be dropping my voice right here and now to see you guys later. Thank you so much for always sailing with me. And do not forget, please, leave and let's leave. Danko. Bye for now, babies.